Welcome back to Judo Breakdowns, your source for judo commentary on the internet. And what I have for you today is a match, or not a match, <laughs> is the Champion's Path, which is the champion of the 2023 Baku Grand Slam in the men's under 81 kilogram division, Zalim Chekhev from uh, Azerbaijan. So we're going to go round by round through each of his matches, go into the highlights. And uh, let's start with round one. Let's fire this thing bad boy up. Okay, we're joining mid-match. He's facing, uh, he's in the blue. Zalim is in the blue. And in white, uh, representing Spain, is Alfonso Urquiza Solana. So right now, uh, you can see that Alfonso has got is on two Shidos. And Zalim is on one. And that is it. That was the, that was it. So no throws were completed here and you saw that that's how he went out that's a i mean come on you, you don't know the rules <laughs> it's very clear uh penalty to me anyways let's okay we're on to round two in white we have georgi gramatikov from bulgaria facing Zal zalim in blue joining mid-match nothing has been scored so far it's only been in about a minute so it's okay Okay, the grip has been established. Now let's move on. Oh. Oh, did he tap? Did he tap? Okay. So it kind of like pulled guard into a juji. Is that is that what we're saying here? Definitely the the uh, Zalim's. Oh, Ipon. So he did tap. He did tap. Oh, pause. Wait, hold on. Okay, he did tap. So that's it. Oh, they're canceling it. <laughs> they're canceling it. And then uh, Zalim is being issued a Shido. I think for, like, he wasn't technically in the Waza when he started applying it. So the standing arbors are no longer allowed. So. Some of that might be what uh, got that. Oh, Uchimada, Wazari. Very nice, Uchimada. Very exciting. Very exciting. We went from a Nippon to a canceled Nippon to a Wazari. All within the space of, like, what? Like, under a minute? That's what we're talking about, actually. Here. Oh. Oh. That was close. Well, if he got that a little bit extra rotation, that would have been a monster. You pull. <laughs> okay, Georgie, you got. I think he's got to like take some risks here, right? Like he's getting dominated. Mm -mm. This is not it. Yeah. Zalim, you know he's got a very, uh, you know upright posture which I like to see especially as a taller taller player oh trying to push him to the corner and Georgie that was smart for him to get him right into the corner but Zalim with the Uchimata ish attack was a good way of getting out of that although I would have liked to see Georgie try to like capitalize knowing that he's going to have to attack Okay. So, oh, there. Oh, no, there we go. There we go. The palm. Oh, these are spectacular throws that that uh, Zalim is going with here. Let's have a look at that again one more time. Yeah. I mean, come on. What are we doing here, Georgie? This is actually. I. When you look at it like this, is this allowed? Is this not a bear hug? I don't know, because that arm is sort of around his left arm. I don't yeah, I don't even like that bear hug rule anyway, so whatever. But anyways, in spectacular fashion, as the lean wins with the knee palm. That's great. Let's move on. Okay. 
semifinals. We find ourselves uh, against Nurbek Murtozoev Myrto from Uzbekistan in the blue. Uh, Zilim is in the white. Now we're going right to golden score. Uh, one penalty for Zalim, two penalties for Nurbek. So this is anything scores, right? So let's see. Oh, oop, there it is. Was I for sure? There we go. Yeah. Woo hoo. Okay. I mean, it went to golden score, but let's. Can we look at that one more time? Uchimata. Look at that. Do you see that? You see that light going right up there? Love to see it. Boom. You know what? To be honest, I don't want to nitpick because, like, it's a great throw. Great, great throw. I don't like seeing this arm like this chicken winged arm. <laughs> I know people do it all the time, but it annoys me. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. Look at that Uchimata. Like, see the amplitude? Maybe the only other thing is finish the throw. Like, Maki Komi right on to. But it kind of did, so. It's good enough. All right. Let's move on. All right. This is your gold medal match. In white, we have Shamil Borshasvili. Borshasvili from. Uh, actually, I don't know what country this is. AUT. What is AUT? Austria? No, I don't. Uh, Austria. Okay, cool. And Zalim, of course, is in the blue. So let's see. That's how. It, okay. I'm not liking how Shamil is pulling back like that. Oh, there it is. It's a good counter. To the Osoto. I'm assuming that's an Osoto. Let's have a look at that again. Uh, the resolution of this is that that becomes the Wazari. And it goes to time. And that's it's basically the winning score there. So let's have a look at this again. Comes and attacks. I mean, it's a lunging type attack. But the body stance of Zalim is like totally not right for it. Right? Like, it's forward. And he's already fully lunged. So there's not much more. It's gonna be. It's hard to like get much action this way. And really, the thing is, is that at the apex, there's not much more drive you can have, right? So see here, this is basically the max that you can have, that you can do. How much more space is there? Like this to this, like, and he's already way over here. So his like. He's passed. He's passed, right? So it's no wonder it's sort of easy to reverse him. What I don't like is that there was a pause to even get into Nawaza. Like, you should have just gone right into Nawaza. Come on. But <laughs> anyways, your uh, gold medal champion in the men's under 81 kilogram uh, at the 2023 Baku Grand Slam, Zalim uh, Chakeev from Azerbaijan. Congratulations to him. And until next match, have a great night.